Hello, I'm Jeffrey K. Horcrims, uh, your internet friend, and these are all the same people who were here before. Now, Walnut. What? <laughs> what could you possibly want from me? Is there any Get new another, business? Any Got another weddings. cauldron tip. <laughs> Is there any new business? <laughs> Anyone else you want to marry? Bektar, <laughs> we appreciate that you took the time to apply for the position of emotional support bird with our company, but uh, I don't <laughs> need it, I'm fine. <laughs> no thank you. Uh, no thank you. Uh, now, uh, Dinar Blitzen, Prince Blitzen, yes. um, how are things at the Yemen Hut? Big Daddy Dinar's Yum Yum Hut, super great owner, employee of the week. First of all, uh, can we talk about me scattering for a minute? Yeah, let's. Like, single-handedly, the worst person. Can I be real Oof. for a minute? Yeah, please. Don't, Disgusted. don't hold back. Disgusted. Oh. Horrible. I'm so sorry. Like, I can't, I can't put into enough words how much of a letdown this person been, how much I dislike this person. I don't even want to. I can't, I'm so happy to be rid of them. Let's never mention their name again. Now. This week, favorite person in the world. Yeah. Me scattering! Oh, yay! 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 You know what? Oh, no. uh, the, the last one on the way out. There's a buzz about them. I've heard. Yeah. You know, I've heard. I've heard, I've heard a lot of chatter. Yeah. You know, there's a there's a there's around. A scuttlebutt. Yeah. Well, you've heard it around. <laughs> I've heard things. So tell them what they've won. Uh, well, me scattering already knows because I'm pretty sure they've won three weeks in a row. Uh, they've won this <laughs> another menu. You're getting all of them. You're gonna paper your walls with them, as far as I'm concerned. Um, uh, and this is also the menu that everyone will get. I guess we'll indeed, get to that. Indeed, indeed. Yep. I'll, I'll I'll go down that oh. right here. Are we allowed to sign them, or is it only your? Signature? No, I think for the for the the winners of the thing, we should all sign them. Dude, just okay. give Everyone's me a stack down. of them. Just take them. Just wanna... take them over to Black Raven and just fucking yeah, go exactly. to work. Yeah, exactly. Just get drunk as shit. Yup. Spill all over them. Who cares? Yeah, yeah. Nasty. Who cares? It's getting weird. Um, now, Rosie Beestinger. Yes. Uh, my understanding is that um, there have been some. Uh, <laughs> Visions in the heavens there have been. that you've uh, cartographed, and the, in recent weeks I've seen shades, ephemera of of. Uh... <laughs> you fucking dork. <laughs> anyway, uh, this constellation is <laughs> <laughs> the eternal student. Uh, is Ooh, the most beautiful star in my hand. sky. Yeah, you kind of button, nudge this <laughs> when you're putting that down. <laughs> you call attention to that. Get out of here <laughs> now. Uh, Kathris, Mr. Drought, I, um, are there any emanations from the void? I, I gazed through that veil. I, I, I parted its curtains. Did anything else happen? Yeah, I saw a lot of stuff. <gasps> Big deal. Oh. Just, to, just to finish the season, oh, the, the Action Earth. Economist. Ooh, the you action may economist. enjoy the Ur itself. The Ur. Wow. Wow. It's for you. It's for Christmas. That is sick. That is really and really a Kit great. Kat. Yeah, oh. uh, free Kit Kat. A vet, when a you buy one, oh. la Kit Kat. Now, Cauldron oh. Tippers. That's a bad throw. Cauldron, Cauldron Tipper. Cauldron Tipper. Yeah. No, now, uh, action economist, Polar Frost nineteen, uh, Zaga Finale, our our own engineer. <laughs> uh, what? Me scattering, uh, Bechdar, Eggs Baker, oh uh, everything, Laskadai, and Echo Steel one seventy one. Goodness gracious! Uh, is there is there not enough room on this thing to even fucking contain Y'all it? Y'all went nuts. This yeah, episode. you went ham. Uh, of course, no, thank you no. very much for the uh, new poll. That's going to inform uh, where we <laughs> spend our first arc. So very tasteful. Um, hey, so uh, it is vitally important that I tell you what uh, Elisa has just told me to tell you, uh, which is that Two uh, PA will be reaching out to the five K menu donors, and even if people don't hear their names. We're still tracking all the way through to the end, so it's all good. Trust me, we have a very clever bot that listens, it yeah. knows all, and sees all. So let me just try to do these yeah, correctly. I'll put it back on yeah. here, too. As fast as humanly yeah. possible. AJ Scorp, Andrew, Ark Thunder 10, Bekdar, Basabe 3, Broken Sentinel, Chthonian Sun, Chris Gow, uh, Danikow, uh, Dino 990, uh, Dino 9900, wow. Doom Cow 3, Echo Steel 171, Everything Eggs Baker, uh, Goblin Slitter, Gramzilla, Hedge Bard, If and Death, Just Some Guy TN, Katrin Melky, Knit Pixie, All. Yeah. Uh, Lamp Lover, uh, Leah from Laie, uh, Me Scattering, Mrs. Bubba, Mysterial One, Nikier, Nudie Licious, mm. I vouch, mm. uh, One Leaf Clover 83, uh, Paco Koala, Planet Bob, Polar Frost 19, Raven Holm 337, Regio, Ritz Bits 9, Rix Gerald, Rush Dark Shadow, Razor Dragon, Sahiko Jones, Snow Dogs, 
Spoopy de Doopy. Oh, nice. Uh, I love Spoopy. Stig's Van Cousin, Pseudo Hop, uh, Sylvian Sly Master, <laughs> Tenuous Light. Oh, thanks you so much. <laughs> uh, much that, appreciated. Steady light. Um, the Action Economist, The Cactus Man 17, oh. The Eternal oh, Student, guy. Tiger King 47, uh -oh. Vid Tuesday, uh, Verkoka, Yithian Historian, oh. Yup, This is GM, and Zemoj. Oh. Hey. Uh, thank hey. you so much uh, for rolling it through. And of course, GM Rocky, uh, this I hear is your uh, Elderwood Academy uh, so, dick box. Nice. For these menus, we'll print them out, we'll all sign them, mm -hmm. then we'll laminate, laminate them, then we'll send them out. Also, fun little fact, this is the last time I'm not going to have this next season. I'm oh, going to change it. You're going to yeah. switch it up? Oh. Yeah. It might be a kid's menu. I don't know. I'm going to oh, do dude. something fun. Oh, do something different. Go, go the Cronar route? Yeah, so this is the last time That's to get them too. So That's awesome. Enjoy. No. <coughs> messed so, up. So I, I should have so said I, that earlier on. <laughs> <laughs> I have got some have... flavor. Uh, I've got some oh. flavor here. Somebody give me a special oh, present. Oh this. my goodness gracious. Here you go. What beautiful handwriting. Yeah, this is uh, Arctic, uh, archaic meander. Goodness gracious, this is... Sign where you want. This is the most incredible handwriting I've ever seen. Don't put it in the box. It's probably worth taking a look at it. Is it Here. personal or...? Well, I don't know, I don't, I don't know. I'm just saying, look at this beautiful handwriting. I'm gonna read it, and then hopefully it, will be, it won't be private. Uh, hopefully it'll be something that I can read to everyone. Uh, since the moment I began listening to the C Team, uh, since listening along the C Team has been a constant source of inspiration and entertainment of the highest caliber, and indeed, it has revived my font of creativity, temporarily rendered dormant by depression. I get that anxiety uh, and the general uh, mundane stressors of daily life. General in this handwriting, it looked like another word, and uh, it wasn't. It was it was this word. Uh, I hope uh, you've all heard, as I believe Amy has, uh, my song about walnuts hand fasting, which is ballin. Mm -hmm. uh, which I recorded solely due to the story power that you all have woven in the inexorable compulsion it foisted upon me to make myself a part of its universe. Your influence on me as a person, a D&D player, and an artist is undeniable. Good lord. That was really sweet. It really Aww. is sweet. There's, 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 there's a second half that I will read um, in the privacy uh, of my own home. Uh, but alongside this, uh, alongside this, we have got these cool business cards. I'm going to put these in the box. <gasps> what? Oh my yeah. god! Well, I mean, it says Documenter level two. I'll well, there's no way they could have known. Yeah. They'll have to work hard nope. to get that back. No Whoa. longer. It's like actual gold foil on there? Yeah, the best part is that they give you copper. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I'm going to hand these out at Oz. They knew. Oh, dude. Super great we decisions. We have to hand these yeah, out at Oz. This that's great. great. Find us at Oz, and we'll give you a business card. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, you get a big old stack of them. Supplies last. Here, no, yeah. hold on a second. So you're you're telling me that I have more stuff, Alyssa? Yeah. More gifts to give? Ooh. Oh my goodness gracious! Look at that bubble wrap. Uh, Popper Leisure Twitch chat. Oh, goodness, sending me some cool stuff to think. Acquisitions Incorporated. What's this? <gasps> Wow. Wow. Notebooks. Whoa. Oh, it's hand painted. Yes. Hand painted. Oh, oh. Everybody, everybody's got a heap of them. Oh. And, and hey. Also, Hoyle's Games Autograph Edition, but it's actually oh. a secret box. Oh my god! What's in the secret box? Oh. Oh no! Look, I, I, it's I, in the box. No, no, I can't. You I can't, tell me she's okay. I can't tell you because this is actually a. Game suggestion for the next season. Ooh. So I'm going to close the Hoyle game. Whoa! I'm going to put that back in there. Um, but Paul per ledger, uh, thank you so much. Oh, and there's some other cool stuff too. So you're talking about the D and D Beyond beta for the UI. Hope you had a yep. chance to goof around with that and see some stuff. Obviously, in a combat-rich adventure, that might be a very fun way uh, to keep track of people's hit points. Um, Pax Oz presence. I mean, we're gonna obviously we have a live game there. Is it is it costumed? Okay, because we would have we would have to send this stuff like two months ago, yeah. right? Um, but we are going to be doing our special Halloween special. Yeah. We should call it that. The oh, special that's Halloween that's special. Good marketing. Oh, um, so we'll we'll Redundant. do the, nice. the the Halloween extravaganza down there, and of course uh, there's the party before the show. Um, it's going to be a real hoot nanny. Now, uh, Idle Champs. Yes. Do you have anything that you can throw in there? More Idle Champs stuff. So here is the final Dinar Ooh. cards. Yay! Yum. Which I'll be handing out at all of the uh, pack stuff. It has a code on it? 
Yeah, so there's codes on the back. Um, Oof, it's not on here. When does when does he officially start? Uh, 26. Next week, right? The 24th. Yeah. 24th? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Dave and I will stream while we're in Australia. Uh, but that's when he comes out. He's released next week on their next big event. I don't know if I'm allowed to say and the these, name of the event. These codes will get you a free dinner. Yeah, so I'll be handing them out and stuff. So there's going to be, uh, in the program for Australia, there's a special uh, code for a variant costume for Dinar where he's in Yum Yum Hut garb. So he's got the apron. Oh. They rendered the apron in there. It looks oh really cute. God. And he's got a little little uh, chef's hat. Um, so that'll be just in the, uh, in the program. We put that in there. Um, and you can access it with those codes. Let's see, we're handing out these cards. I'll give these cards all over the place. Um, let's see. Instead of doing, oh, and for those who play the game, here's his abilities now. I think it's hilarious. So he's got toothbrush, he's got this massive sword, and they drew it like anime style. As I was like, can you please make it as big as possible? And they were like, yep. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, I want berserk level guts, like giant sword. He's got this giant sword. He doesn't swing his giant sword. His attack is he uses command the whole time. <laughs> so he makes a decision during the game for the team what's the best thing to do. So he is like, which is basically going to end up being RNG, but it's um, he, he's like yelling at the uh, opponents as they come in, and they'll either be stunned, they'll flee, which means they'll get pushed all the way back to, to take more damage. Uh, they'll get scared, 25% chance they miss, or drop their stuff, uh, which means they'll just drop a bunch more gold. Mm -hmm. And he also heals everyone that's behind him because he's wow. inspiring. So if you put him at the front, he inspires everyone behind. That's great. I, that was really cute. And then his ultimate attack is that he will... Uh, uh, then he attacks with Toothbrush. He kind of, I think he bounces around the screen, screen attacks with Toothbrush, and then comes back and vomits acid yes, there in is. a pool yes. that does AOE damage, so anyone who walks through it gets hurt. Which, yes. uh, it was, you seem quite pleased. Brand. I gotta tell you, it was so much fun freaking these guys. Oh, like, first awesome. of all, I thought this was really cool. Oh, yeah. uh, but they were really, but they, really they, nice. They, they give a shit. Oh, like, they totally do. Right? And the, the descriptions, I still have to finish uh, doing punch up on the copy, but uh, the descriptions they wrote for all the items were like, Super cute. You can tell they, they, they watched at least they a handful of episodes. Yeah, there was so some cool. some cute digs in there. Yeah. I was like, oh, little callbacks and stuff. Here, so but all the cape, a coin, Percival, and toothbrush. Yes. Noise. And the ultimate version of toothbrush is toothbrush. Nice, of course. Yeah. As it should be. Yeah. Toothbrush. Now, uh, Alyssa, uh, I'm going to uh, indicate the cool contents of this box. Um, and then we'll get into some questions, and that'll be the end of the season, I guess. Drinking this yes, um, so. Yeah, yeah, so the level up meet and greet that's at Oz, that's that's the night before, right? Thursday? Where is it? You, this is important information! Here, while it's, you find out... It's uh, on the street. I'm gonna go into it's this. in Australia. So, we'll be uh, walking. So, so Mitsuhani, Milner. we are oh, yeah. all familiar, right? Uh, Elizabeth Rankin, uh, thank you for your continued labors. I hope I can say hi at a PAX in person someday. There's other content here, but... Uh, I, they've had a physical tea bar for a few years now. Oh, oh. wow, working out. Oh. oh my goodness, so get a load of this. I'm not even gonna say what it is. Just put it in the box. Mm, mm. Put it yeah. in the box. Oh my god! Yeah. We've got a red larch tea, we've got an ur tea. Mm, I wonder what's going on with that. Oh, that sounds what? pretty. Here. <laughs> Strix's oh. apple pie. Robe of stars, mm. yeah. I love all coat. the people that send us tea. <laughs> I do the too. last, I know. The I last batch too. of tea we got was yum awesome. Yum yum hut. Oh, yum yum. Oh, yum yum. Whoa. That was my reaction. <gasps> Daughter to of it. the EPA. Oh man. Oh, is that one for me too? Over. Oh, look at this one. Oh man. <laughs> this one's called Ruby Rod of Asmodeus. Hmm. Very oh. good. God, it smells so good here. Try this one. So smell this scent. Not, not your grandma's tea. Ooh, uh, sweet so, uh, Mitsuhani of the uh, Black Lotus Tea Company, uh, thank you so much. What a what a really interesting treasure. Like one of the coolest things about this is how much creativity seems to exist in the space around the game. Like if you make something and then it makes someone else make something, like that has to be that has to be considered a uh, a virtuous cycle. That's oh, this awesome. feels like a. I want to see the sniffs. Um, uh, yep. Uh, so Echo Steel one seventy one says, "Oh, oh, MVP, MVP." Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Um, what was the MVP? What was an inanimate object? Um, the trees that turned into Druid army. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah. 
The cake with the seven daggers. <laughs> the badge. Oh, the badge gift. You know what? I gotta give it you to you. You guys didn't get her anything. Broken table. You <laughs> just gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Um. Yeah, those trees were pretty great for me personally. Yeah, it worked for you. If anybody has anything better than uh, a hidden army in a forest, please yeah. feel free to Working speak up. now. <laughs> I think you win that one. Or that badge, which was the only great wedding present that she got. Yeah. Yep. Cathris blue, dinar acid green, rosy purple, and walnut red pens. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, from Paul. Thank very you. tasteful. Very tasteful. No. Oh, um, level up meet and greet. Yes, yeah. The level up meet and greet is at the um, uh, March board game. Uh, March board. March board. Uh, level up game cafe at 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. Uh, of course, you know. After you've done that flight and then you're in Australia, life becomes very, very surreal. Uh, so those conversations should be very interesting. You'll definitely want to take full advantage of that. Um, oh, I've been there for like a week, so... Get, get money from me... Chat me up. At, ...if you can at that time. Uh, Echo Steel 171 says, Jerry, if you had to summarize Season 3 with one word... Three? What would it be? And the upcoming one? Well, yeah, the, the next one. Oh, here, let's see. Three. <laughs> Third. Um, <laughs> Yeah, just you wait. That'll that'll bear out. That'll be true. Yeah, th- three would definitely be apotheosis. Like no, nope, we skip right to four. Three. Apotheosis yeah. is your word for season apotheosis? three. Apotheosis. Yeah, look it up. My guy. Um, Google this. Maholier to Jesus says, "Does Rosie consider her tenure with the C team uh, as a penance or a punishment for her deal with Asmodeus?" No, not at all. Um, the C team is pure joy. Oh, it means climax. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. Tasty Kudzu uh, says, Amy, do you ever get mad at Jerry for the shit that he does to Walnut? Yep. Yeah. Hmm. And then I talk, have to talk to him. We in, talk about it. In the car on the ride home about mm-hmm. it. Like a half hour therapy. It session. might happen tonight. But then I have to go, Jerry, we're friends, right? Because I need that validation <laughs> that he's not doing it to me hmm. on purpose. But he's doing it near you. It is yeah. very enjoyable to watch, but I imagine it would not be enjoyable to be it. It's a lot of work. It's hard. It's a lot of work. Uh, BT Robot, Dinar seems to be doing a lot of things that might be considered evil. Is he what? changing alignment? What do you think is evil? Well, you made friends with Asmodeus. He's a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, no, no. Listen, <laughs> Look, lots of... Here. ignorant kid doesn't mean you're evil. No, Ignorance lots of, isn't evil. No, lots of good people end up on the wrong side of a deal. Yeah. With Asmodeus. Listen, right? I want to just like a little bit of shout out to Jerry for some kick ass role playing today. <laughs> I yeah. think he's the real MVP. You know what I mean? Oh. Just he's an admin. He's not living. So. No, of course not. Yeah. Uh, hey, so Look that's uh, her fault. So, um, <laughs> some sort of like. Like shambling, Ooh. talking a sponge. Shambling mound. Yeah. yeah. Pavlovian. Can Dinar be an oathbreaker paladin oh. uh, against a deity that lives inside him? Mm-hmm. That'd be difficult. Why would he? Rat. Yeah. yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, why would he? He loves it. He loves Vars Malus. No, he's... he's well, he feels a little... Uh, are you there, God? It's me, Dinar. Because <laughs> he's <laughs> <laughs> like, I saw you once, like, why aren't you responding to it? But It seems really bratty. I mean, and that's kind of Dinar, but it's like, I summoned a God out of myself once. How come I can do it yeah. again? You're in there. Just How punching, hard could it be? Just getting yeah. mad, eating spicy foods. You like that? Washing the floor. Him out. <laughs> yeah. You're punishing him. Yeah. But the eternal student says that. He's uh, lashing himself, but yeah. only because the God's in him. He's like, it hurts yeah. me, it hurts you, probably. Let's hope. Let's hope that's how it works. Can the C team uh, even sell their souls, or is that right given to Omen? Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Omen is the hero of this campaign. Mm-hmm. He's a very good person. Mm-hmm. Um, Catwalk 22, there's, no, there's nothing you should think about very hard when it comes to the first season of the show and Omen's behavior. You should not consider it long uh, over this break. Well, okay. I guess that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, Catwalk 22, Kate, in Rosie's long, colorful life, has she ever married? Oh, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure she made that choice at some point. Oh, sure. And she's done weird ones. Like, she's done real hippie ones that are just, like, last a week or whatever because she's on some weird, like, Burning Man thing. thing. Yeah. Um, she's probably accidentally gotten married to a couple of people because of strange cultural demands. Mm. Um Certainly some like actual marriages out of love. I think canonically she had at least there's there's a uh, someone who made a character who asked if he could be one of Rosie's ex-husbands. And I was oh, like, oh hell yeah. That's amazing. Course. Yeah. Because yeah. because that doesn't that's not actually a complete idea. A, yeah, there's yeah. so much information, but mm. there's so much 
possibility around the edge yeah, of that, right? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it was really cool. But yeah, she's she's totally been married. She's pretty casual about it. Uh, Unreal Ed says, uh, Jerry, have you considered potentially maybe never stopping the C-team uh, and just having it always and forever? Just a thought. Uh, Alyssa needs to do other things on occasion. I can't just have Alyssa uh, enable me in my Dungeons and Dragons uh, Why scenarios. not? 24-7? 365? She said, like, she, she said yes. Hey. She said yes. She said yes. Hey, uh, first, congratulations on a fantastic season. Thank you, McKenna Blue. Hey, secondly, I have been the father of a human girl oh. uh, for a month and a half now. Hey. What advice does Rosie have for a new parent? Any words of wisdom from the rest of the table? Well, speaking as someone at this table who's definitely had my own biological children. It's not true. Um, I would say, <laughs> advice for your daughter. Uh, real advice that Rosie would give you is let her make her own mistakes when it's time. Oh yeah. And don't you can't keep them safe forever, and you don't want to. So definitely, definitely let her fuck up a little bit, and <clears throat> she'll be better for it. You got to. You got to. Uh, I'm gonna crack a few more of these here. Bryceling, do you guys have withdrawals like I do when you aren't on stream? Absolutely. Uh huh. The brakes are. Don't think. I don't think about it at all. The brakes are. Right until we mic up. <laughs> incredibly <laughs> painful for all of us. Yeah, this sucks shit. The only the only yeah. consolation I have is that we're going to Australia together. Woo! Oh, oh, dude, Woo! I'm telling you, I got the ramen spot. You come with me. Oh yeah. Um, uh, Kanan Flaxvine says, "Is Dinara's surprising transformation a portent from the Ur? Uh, there is lots oh. more to learn about Dinar next That's season. Oh. But Dinar has his oh. own. Well, because arc. he's a bear." I yeah. get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah bear. Uh, the <laughs> truth. <laughs> uh, uh, the fact of the matter. Obviously, the Ur probably has something revelatory about every phenomenon. Yeah. Um, That's but, more. I would imagine more with Vars Malus than yeah. with the bear curse. Exactly. Uh, uh, Holly took the rings back to the Waffle Crew. What about the return of the collateral? Still waiting on it. Yeah, yeah. still waiting on it. Not back yet. Dear. That's what's gonna happen. Get waffle, it. waffle. That receipt. Waffles That's Incorporated. 30, so number two. It's where we bust position. in the door. Cool. Oh shit! Done, done. done. <laughs> now next uh, summer event, we go to their house and we beat them all up and we take the money back. See, this is the kind of documenter we have now. Uh, Katara two O, <laughs> uh, question for the next season: Will there be changes to the animation in the opening credits? Probably. Walnuts, marriage, where bear, dinar, shadow council, assassin, Rosie, crazy eyes, Kathris. Who knows? It's pretty busy stuff. <laughs> so I don't know. Yeah. yeah. It's it's the idea that it stacks though. There's a season. yeah. Obviously, there is. Just, just strap more shit on yourself. Yeah. <laughs> just keep putting it over there. Um, hey, and so a couple things. One, everybody wins. Uh, no. So I'm gonna mm. all all of the uh, <laughs> charges. Uh, we are compressing, yeah. squeezing together. Uh-huh. Uh huh. And my mathematics, if they hold, okay. Uh, I'm gonna transform them into XP. Uh, and so uh, the first thing that you should do, in fact, why don't you do it before, uh, do it before the Halloween special? Uh, an Oz. Give yourself two levels. What? What the f? Level ten, motherfucker. Level ten. Give yourself two levels. I'm level um, eleven. And then, uh, and then we'll come back there. We'll put it together, and then you guys will have you guys will have a chance on stage uh, to try out all your newest shit. <gasps> Holy shit! It's too powerful. Super excited uh, about uh, it. One man should have all the uh, power. Uh, Oh. Shadow Council, Those may our labors please you. Thank you so much uh, for coming and spending season two with us. Season three on the way, but of course, uh, in the intermeeting in but. the intermeeting period, we got Halloween special, Christmas special, Waffles Inc. podcast, two hours worth of content. Um, you know, you'll be in our thoughts. Uh, Godspeed, and we'll Prayers. see you next time.